Everyone who is a born-again believer has great value in the kingdom of God. Tony Broom Ministries presents the following devotional message called, Everyone Has Something. I have one verse of scripture in 1 Corinthians chapter 14, verse 26. How is it then, brethren, when you come together, every one of you hath a psalm, hath a doctrine, hath a tongue, hath a revelation, hath an interpretation. Let all things be done unto edify. Everyone has something to contribute. He says when you come together, every one of you has something. That's a good thing to know because a lot of times in this world, not everyone has something. The rich might have something. The elite might have something. But not everyone. In the kingdom of God, everyone has something. Everyone is of value. Everyone can contribute. In the teams of this world, when you have sports or you have Olympics and all this, just one person wins. Just one team wins. But in the kingdom of God, everybody wins. If you're born again, you're a winner. Everybody wins in the kingdom of God. Everyone has something. Everyone has something to give. It's good to know that. You may not have the same thing I do. I may not have the same thing you do, but everyone has something to give. We always think that's about money, but it means a whole lot more than money. Paul teaches in 1 Corinthians chapter 12 about the spiritual gifts, in chapter 13 about love, and in chapter 14 about the operation of tongues and prophecy and the gifts. And in that chapter, that verse that we just read, he said, when you come together, every one of you has something. Everyone has something to contribute. And it's good to know that it's not just the preacher. It's not just the connect class teacher. It's not just an elder. But everyone has something. Everyone has something to contribute. And everyone has something different. You don't have to have the same thing. When you come together, brothers, every one of you has a psalm, has a doctrine, has a tongue, a revelation, or an interpretation. There are five things here that are different. All of them are different. They all work together to glorify God, to bless the body of Christ, but all of them are different. Everyone has something to contribute. Everyone has something different. Everyone has something to give. Everyone has something to contribute, and everyone has something different. One might have a psalm. A psalm is a scripture song. You just praise God and worship Him the scripture song is about praise and about worship. And then someone else may have doctrine. Doctrine is teaching. You teach the word. It may or may not be praise and worship. Sometimes you have praise and worship and you bless the name of the Lord. And then other times you teach. It takes both of them. It's a seesaw balanced one against the other. And if it's balanced properly... The seesaw doesn't go one way or the other. It's straight line balance. You have psalm and you have doctrine. And they balance out each other. And then you have tongues and he will bring forth a message. You have revelation. Sometimes the spirit of prophecy will come upon the body of Christ. When you come together, everyone has something different. It may be a psalm. It may be a doctrine. It may be a tongue a revelation or an interpretation. You're interpreting what has been spoken. Everyone has something with which to edify. And the part of the verse said, let all things be done unto edifying. To edify the body of Christ. And he said when you excel in these spiritual gifts, that you would excel to the edifying of the church, the building up of the body of Christ. The church needs building up, not only physically in a building and not only numerically, but the church needs building up in our spirit. We need building up in the faith, and we need building up and booing up in love, and we need to build each other up to continue to edify each other and keep each other lifted up. There's so much in this world 
that brings you down and puts you down and so much negativity on the news and everywhere you look. And the medical scene is even all the negative things that are going on. But in the body of Christ, it is edifying and building up. Oikoyon and all the words that sound like that. It's like building a house in Greek. The oikoya is building up. We need to do all things and let all things be done unto edifying. Everyone has something to give that will edify and lift up the body of Christ. And I encourage us all to be an edifier. Don't be a negifier. Don't be a gossiper. Don't be a putter downer. But be a lifter upper. Be an edifier to upbuild the kingdom of God. Jesus said, if you're not for me, you're against me. And we have to be for Him. We have to live for Him and lift each other up and build each other up in the faith. Everyone has something. By now, I hope you understand that you are equal with all the other members of the body of Christ. And, if you're not part of His body, the church, you can be today. Just ask Christ to come into your heart and save you and be your Lord. Everyone has something, has been a Tony Broom Ministries production.